Hello everyone and welcome back. So today we are going to continue on here in Genshin Impact. So let's go ahead and... So we are just going to do the daily commissions at the moment. Okay, this is somehow easy work. Next one is over this way. Wing 
blade. I'll protect us. Okay, where's the next one? Down this way? Alrighty. Dr. Livingstone? the wrong thing. Okay. While well, I'm here...
exactly get there. Okay. Next one's near Cape Oath. Let's go here, so we can go to the Adventure Guild. Ad Astra Abyssosk, welcome Thank you for completing today's com Ad Astra Abyss. Okay, let's go ahead and name all. Dispatch again. Thank you. 
Okay. So that's that. Okay. That should do it for that. Cross shield potion. All right. I know I still need to finish this area, but I'm going to do that on my own. I also know I need to get the rest of Leeway, but I will do that later. There's stuff in here that I need to do as well. Let me see... Alright, I know I unlocked Barbara last 
time I play. Um, you know what? Let's go ahead and do one of her hangouts. I sure hope Sister Barbara is okay. Sister Barbara said that she was going out to pick some herbs earlier, but I'm afraid that she has yet to return. Hmm. Perhaps I should report the matter to the Knights of Havonius. You? Well, I guess as the honorary knight, you may very well be a good fit for the task. Not to mention it would save me the trouble of reporting the matter to the Knights. All right. I'll leave it to you. Before Sister Barbara departed, she said that she was headed to Wolvendom to pick some herbs. You could start by looking for her there. Okay. So, let's go ahead and go there first. Get healed just a bit. Then go here. Because from here. Doesn't take too long. <sighs> How strange. I can't seem to find any. Oh, oh, it's you. What are you doing here? Is something the matter? Oh, I see. No need to worry. There hasn't been any sign of danger. I'm just here to gather some red wolf hook berries, that's all. But the strange thing is, there should be lots of them here. And I can't seem to find any. Hmm. Well, anyway, no need to worry about me. I'll just have another look around here, and if I can't find any, I'll just... Miss Barbara? Huh. She's not here either. Huh? Oh, somebody seems to be coming this way. Oh, I'm sorry, but please just keep quiet, okay? Don't let them find us. Because... Well, just because. All right, then. Let's head this way. Keep your voice down. We mustn't let that person find us here. Oh, this should be a good spot. Let's wait here for a while. Well... 
It's a little embarrassing to say, but... In Mondstadt, I often perform songs for people. Because it's been so well received, the other sisters have started encouraging me to perform across Tivat. Now, more and more people are showing up to hear me perform. I'm happy to see such turnouts, don't get me wrong. But now, people always stop me on the street when I go shopping or when I go out for personal matters. I know that all they want is to get my autograph or to ask me how I'm doing, which isn't a bad thing. And I'm very thankful for all my fans, but... Oh, there are simply too many of them. I always do my best to fulfill their requests and not let them down. But... Sometimes... I feel that I just don't have the strength to do so. Even when I'm in the church, people will still come hoping to greet me. I'm constantly in a state of tension no matter where I go. The reason I came here was not only to find wolf hooks for making Tunner's cough medicine, but also to have some quiet time alone. Do you understand that feeling? To sit peacefully and not think about anything? Just by yourself? It's simply the feeling of relaxation. It's been far too long since I've had that feeling. Before I knew it, I was out here all day and forgot to return to the city. Well, yes, there are plenty of the normal variety. But I'm looking for red wolf hooks. No matter how hard I look, I can't seem to find any. I clearly remember that they always grow here. I guess that's all we can do for now. Although it certainly isn't nice to treat someone that way. But today, I simply wish to keep to myself. Wh huh? Wh what do you mean? Y you... Uh, I'm sorry. I think we should go. Yes, it's time to go. I made the wrong decision. Shh. Keep your... Oh, this should be a good... Well, in Mondstadt, I'm happy to see... I know that, and... I, I always do my best, but even when I'm in the ch the reason I came, do you understand that feeling? It's been far. Oh yes. I guess that's all. My family? Well, my father left on an expedition together with Grandmaster Varka and has yet to return. And as for the other person I can call family, well. She doesn't have much time to look after me. And besides, I'm more than capable of taking care of myself, so there's no need for me to bother her. <laughs> That's right! The Grand Master of the Knights of Favonius. I'm sure you've heard his name mentioned before. Seamus Pegg, the Cardinal of Daybreak and the Seneschal of the Church of Favonius. That's my father. But it's been some time since I last saw him. And I'm still uncertain of when Grandmaster Varka's expedition will finally be finished. I don't know. My father only briefly mentioned the matter to me before he set off. He also turned over all his responsibilities in the church to Cardinal Calvin. Cardinal Calvin has been taking care of various matters since the departure of my father and Grandmaster Varka. He's so busy that he seldom ever leaves his room. Even the other sisters in the church rarely ever see him. The only time I've seen him recently was when the Holy Larger Hamel was stolen. He went to the Knights of Favonius in such a hurry that he hadn't even fastened all the buttons on his garments. Speaking of which, you still remember that day, right? You recovered the Holy Lyre to Hamel together with that bard and Jean. Oh, I mean, the acting Grand Master. Oh, I was shocked to see the Holy Lyre to Hamel in such a condition. Thank the heavens that the bard was able to mend it. 
We'd never hear the end of it from Cardinal Calvin if something were to ever happen to the Holy Lyre to her mouth. Huh? What do you two seem so nervous about? There's nothing wrong with the Holy Lyre to her mouth. Is there? Well, anyway... At least the Holy Lyre de Hermel is fixed. Never mind the Lyre for now. I think that person should be long gone. And I still need to pick those wolf hooks. Well, I can't seem to find any of the red variety anywhere. Oh, your help would be much appreciated. Let's search the nearby area. I'm sure we'll find some in no time. Strange. I'm almost certain I've seen lots of red wolf hooks growing here before. dark spots. <laughs> like in logs, like these. There's one more. to find some red wolf hook berries? Let me have a look. Uh, yep, that should be enough. But it's still strange. I know for sure that I've seen lots of red wolf hooks growing here before. I wonder if someone had already gathered them all. Well, never mind. Thankfully, the berries you gathered should be just enough. Let's go! made it out of there. The Wolvendom Forest is a nice getaway to be alone for a while, but there's not much sunlight. If you stay in there for too long, you can't help but start feeling a little gloomy. A little sunlight always helps keep your spirits up. Ah, yes. Now that we're here, 
I'd like to go to Don Winery and check on Tunner's condition. I've told him before that he should take it easy and rest for a while, but he never seems to listen. He even told me not to let Guy know anything about it. I'd like to check on him before going back and deciding which medicine I'll need to make. Um, would it be possible to, well, you know, ask for your help again? If you could go back and report to Sister Victoria while I check on Tunner, oh, that would be a big help. She's most certainly worried about me after being away so long. And besides, there's a lot of matters I still need to take care of back at the cathedral. It would be better if I let her know the situation. Oh, thank you so much. I truly appreciate it. All right. Let's go ahead and get back to the cathedral. back again if you're looking for sister Barbara she's yet to return oh I see <sighs> think Barbados that she's all right but it sounds like she won't be back anytime soon hmm. perhaps I'll have to pass her responsibilities in the cathedral to someone else oh well that's most kind of you I certainly wouldn't want to trouble you hmm let me think for a moment. Ah, yes, you could help tidy up around the cathedral a bit. People tend to bring dust in as they come into the cathedral, so the floor is often quite dirty. Cleaning and the like have always been Sister Barbara's responsibility. So the moment she's gone, everything starts getting dirty. Yes, that's right. She always said that she could handle it herself and that there's no need to ask anyone else to help her. But she does often appear quite exhausted after she's finished with the cleaning. To be honest, I'm most surprised that you are willing to help. Or rather that Barbara is willing to let you help. However, this would help to lighten her burden. Anyway, I'll let you handle the cleaning for now, honorary knight. All right, get the cleaning. a good thing oh, that hey. I have Barbara as party member. So it's outside again. Huh? Well, that should just about do it for the 
the cleaning. Could Barbara really do this all herself? Sister Victoria told me you already helped tidy up the cathedral. Thank you so much. I just returned a short while ago. I can't thank you enough for how much you've helped me today. Both here in the cathedral and back in Wolvendom. You must be thirsty after so much work, no? How about I treat you to a drink? Oh, I've just remembered that the cat's tail is promoting a special drink recently. Miss Margaret said that the name of the drink is Fantastic Summer Serendipity Coral Sparkling Tea. <laughs> she also mentioned that it's her secret weapon to beating Angel's share in drink sales. Word is that the drink's pretty good, but there's always a line to get it. We'll probably have to wait if we want some. If you'd rather not stand in line, I could make you a glass of my very own chili brew. Which would you like to drink? Coming right up! But I should warn you, the flavor is quite unique. I'm not sure how you'll handle it. Alright, let me think. To make this drink, we'll need some fresh Juyun chilies and sweet flowers. The key to a good batch of chili brew is not the quantity of ingredients, but the quality of ingredients. I know where to gather fresh Juyun chilies, but sweet flowers might be a bit tricky. Though they're easy to find, High quality sweet flowers are few and far between. Oh, why don't we split up to search for ingredients? Once we've found the ingredients we need, we can meet up just south of the Whispering Woods. <sighs> All right, I'll head to the Whispering Woods to gather sweet flowers while you go search for Julia and Chili's around Stone Gate. Alrighty. Oh, and by the way, even though I've already requested a half day's leave from Sister Victoria, she always insists that I still give her my itinerary for any trips I take. While I head over to the Whispering Woods, could you please check in with Sister Victoria and let her know where I will be? Oh, gods. <laughs> Anything the knights can do for you? Yes, my child. Oh? Sister Barbara wishes to go to the Whispering Woods to pick herbs. I see. In fact, Sister Barbara just requested a half day's leave to go meet a friend. Now she suddenly intends to go herb picking? I'm sure Sister Barbara has her reasons. Will you be accompanying her? Ah, <sighs> I trust she will be in good hands then. Please take good care of Sister Barbara, honorary knight. Well, as you may already know, Sister Barbara is quite popular in Mondstadt for several reasons. Although the citizens here may only be acting out of good intention, there are too many of them, and Sister Barbara can't handle it all. If they appear while she is working here at the church, we can come and intervene. But if she's approached by fans during her time off, then she can only fend for herself. And not to mention, she's too... Kind. She'll always try to fulfill the requests of the citizens of Mondstadt, even when it takes a heavy toll and leaves her more exhausted than actual working hours. So with that in mind, we thought we'd have Sister Barbara always tell us where she'd be, just in case we need to come rescue her from the crowds. My hope is that Sister Barbara stops pushing herself so hard. Honestly? <laughs> Shouldn't be doing. <laughs> A lot of the stuff that she's doing, but There's a chest.
awesome. These are fresh, all right. Paimon can feel the spiciness just by holding them. Let's go to the Whispering Woods and find Barbara. I must leave no stone unturned. I'll keep this close. Okay. Go here. Should be almost done with this hangout quest, hopefully. short, I was picking sweet flowers and suddenly a group of treasure hoarders appeared. They'd seized a merchant of some kind and were pushing her around. It sounded like they were demanding money from her. I took cover right away, but I've been trailing them ever since. I guess they were too caught up with the merchant to notice me. I followed them this far, but it seemed like they knew somebody was following them, so I didn't go any further. Don't worry about me. They're only treasure hoarders after all. Anyway, I've got a vision. It's enough to protect myself. As for the person they seized, they might be in danger. That's why I was secretly trailing them. I thought of getting the knights involved, but I was worried it would take too long. What if the treasure hoarders did something terrible while I was gone? I was trying to think of some way of rescuing the merchant when you showed up. So, honorary knight, maybe you could, uh... Yay! I'll leave it to you, Honorary Knight. I'll handle the aftercare. Alright, let's do this. Who dares enter our territory? <laughs> Another Release your hostage immediately! <laughs> so you want to play the hero? Uh, Order! Uh, Seize the girl! Let's see if this idiot wizard dares make a move. Oh no! They're going after Barbara! We've gotta... Don't worry about me. <laughs> I'm a vision bearer after all. I'll handle these guys. 
You go rescue the merchant. She's got a vision. Boss, what should we do? What are you scared of? She's just a girl, so what if she's got a vision? There are more of us. Quit stalling and get her. Uh, I'll protect us. <laughs> We'll do that in just a second. I just want to get you on the thing. Thank you. I, I can't express my gratitude. I'm a merchant from Liua. I, I was on my way to Mondstadt. I had no idea there were treasure hoarders on the road. They seized me and brought me here. <sighs> if it weren't for you, gods know what would have happened to me. Oh, please allow me to repay your kindness. The treasure hoarders already made off with most of my things, but let me see here. Um, so there are still a few bottles of chili brew, a few sweet flowers, and here's some aura. No, 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 we don't need a reward. Rescuing those in need is only natural. Besides, I'm the deaconess of the Church of Pavonius, and this is the Knights of Pavonius Honorary Night. As a visitor from Liyue, we have a duty to guard your safety. I won't hear of it. You rescued me. It's only right that your kindness is repaid. I'm afraid I have nothing of great value to offer, but please choose what you like. Um... Okay... I just don't know what to choose. Liyue chili brew might be delicious, but with those sweet flowers, I'd have enough ingredients to make my own. I know. You have way more adventuring experience than me. You'll be better at this. You choose. What do you think is the most fitting reward? Yes, adventurers are savvy when it comes to rewards. What'll it be? Leo's famous chili brew, sweet flowers, or Mora? Really? Sweet flowers and a chili brew? I guess it's all chili brew at the end of the day, but... The Mondstadt version sure sounds interesting. Sweet flowers it is. These are an excellent batch. <laughs> Thanks again for your help. I better get moving. These sweet flowers look fantastic. And now we've finally got all the ingredients we need for the chili brew. Let's get back to Mondstadt. When we're inside the city, why don't you wait for me in the garden next to the Adventurer's Guild? When the chili brew is ready, I'll bring it straight over. Well, all right then. Actually, hold on. Which one's closest? This one.
sorry for the delay. The chili brew's ready. Why don't we drink these here? Here. This one is for you. Let me know what you think. Really? Is the flavor okay for you? I was worried you might not like it. Well, I like chili brew because... Uh, oh, actually, it's a little embarrassing. At first, I drank chili brew just to keep me awake. When I first began singing practice, I had to get up early every day. After practice, I would go to work at the church to take care of official matters. But because I was getting up so early, my singing wasn't getting any better. Sometimes I'd be half asleep singing the wrong lyrics. It was a disaster. I went to people for advice on how to stay awake. They had all kinds of methods. Running, chewing mint, one adventurer even told me that they'd fight slimes to stave off sleep. None of those ideas worked for me. They were too time-consuming. By the time I started to feel awake, there was hardly any time left for practice. <laughs> that was until I started chewing chewing and chilies. <laughs> That's what Sarah said. She told me not to chew them, but to use the Julian chilies to make some kind of drink, something milder in flavor. Using sweet flowers to temper the flavor was also her idea. That's when I started using this new and improved chili brew method. After a while, I actually started to enjoy the flavor. Whenever I drank it, the spiciness would always push me to work harder. I don't know what to say. My determination is nothing compared to yours. I heard Amber say that you're traveling far and wide looking for your sibling. Is that true? Oh, the things you faced, and those yet to come, are more difficult than a few bad songs. Even if I can't assist you in other ways, when it comes to healing, you can count on me. No matter the wound, I will help you recover. Oh. <sighs> Have I said too much? <laughs> Sorry, I'm not used to taking a break. I keep boring you to death. It's not often I get so much freedom. Let's just take our time and drink our drinks. Tomorrow, it's back to chasing our dreams with hard work. I hope our dreams can come true in the end. I am actually going to go ahead and end it here for today, y'all. Thank y'all so much for watching, and I will see y'all tomorrow with more Pokemon Battle Revolution. Bye, y'all.